Hello, my name is David Rota. Hello, my name is David Rota. I'm the chef at the Hotel Oaksen in Saig in the Black Forest, and today I'm going to show you how I test the quality of my cooking oil using the new Testo 270. The Testo 270 measures the so-called polar components of the oil. But first, I take the food out of the deep fryer. Because if there's food in the oil, there's water too, and that increases the polar components of the oil, which leads to false measurements. This is my Testo 270. I switch it on. The cooking oil tester is in auto hold mode. That makes the measurement easier. We are ready to go. When there are no more bubbles rising, I know that there is no water left in the oil, and I can start. For the measurement, it's important that the plastic parts of the Testo 270 don't come into contact with the oil, and that I maintain a minimum distance of one centimeter to metal parts. The right immersion depth is also important. This should ideally be between the minimum and maximum marks on the probe. In order to shorten the measurement time, I move the sensor in small circles in the oil. In the auto hold mode, the display with the readings starts to flash. As soon as the measurement value is stable, the display freezes. That's it. Careful, the probe is very hot. Please don't touch it. The measurement results appear in the display. The smaller value shows the temperature of the cooking oil. The larger value, and the more important one, is the TPM value. This gives the polar components in the oil, which are a sure indicator for the quality of the cooking oil. This percentage is interpreted by the backlighting of the display in traffic light colors. In our case, the display is green. Our TPM value is 14%, so everything's okay. I could now carry on with more measurements without any problems. I just need to clean the Testo 270 with a soft paper towel. However, since I've finished, I'll first note the measurement values and then clean the measuring instrument thoroughly under running water. Because the Testo 270 is splashproof, it's no problem to hold it under running water. To clean it, it's enough to clean the sensor under running water with a mild detergent. It's important not to use any aggressive cleaning products or abrasive sponges. And then simply dry it off carefully with a soft paper towel. Done. As you can see, with the Testo 270, I can very quickly determine the quality of my cooking oil. I adhere to the TPM limit values, ensure the quality of my oil and the deep-fried foods, and on top of that, I can reduce my expenses for cooking oil by up to 20%.